Uh, I gave in speed up. I think uh, the uh, combining the previous years as well as this year's around fourteen to fifteen tests. Sir. After uh, I watched videos, I realized that uh, I was not focusing on the right things, or I understood things uh, uh, in a way. I mean, things are to be understood in a different way, and rather than what I was uh, doing. So I bring in all the wishes and greetings on behalf of all the faculty members of Speed Medical Institute to Dr. J. Mehta for scoring a topmost rank of AML three in specialty of MCH Urology. Uh, in any ss session uh, april 2024 congratulations to you doctor thank you so much sir thank you great so can we know a brief background of yourself from where you started from till date what all you have done okay sir uh, so sir i am currently a 6th semester general surgery resident at uh, uh, pjmr chandigarh sir excellent uh, yes sir so uh, basically i have done my ug from uh, indore mahatma gandhi memorial medical college and then i joined ms general surgery here at pga uh, in uh, april, july 21 and so now i am a six semester resident and uh, now i'll be joining hopefully mcs urology sir <laughs> <laughs> so why urology uh, sir i guess uh, uh, i got sir inclined towards urology after my peripheral posting like uh, I was, when i was posted here in urology in my fourth semester after that i developed interest in neurology as uh, i did some minor procedures in neurology and that i think it's a complete branch sir as in uh, we get to do you know the the everything like open surgery lab robotic endo urology and uh, it, it 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 offers you a, it, it is a, it is a branch where uh, it offers you um, independence re- relative to other branches okay that's what i think sir k uh, that's what it it made me inclined towards neurology sir see once you have decided to get on to urology now then what did you do I mean what did you do uh, to from there on to prepare and what are your preparation strategies to reach rank number 3 yes sir uh, sir so uh, during my fourth semester uh, like during my urology postings only i started reading campbell sir campbell urology and uh, th- at that time sir i was not sure that uh, i'll be pursuing urology as my career but just because i was inclined i started reading, reading urology and uh, as i started reading urology as as i read i was interested in it so uh, in my fifth semester sir i watched the uh, urology videos uh, and from speed sir they were very elaborate and they were very nicely covered the topics basically sir i was finding it difficult to move in a proper direction because campbell is in a very extensive textbook so i did not know what topics to read or what things to focus on so those videos gave me basically uh, the a background idea about what topics to focus on what topics to read for the exam or which are the asked questions in the exam so that was important thing for me sir they gave me a direction and uh, with that sir uh, with the watching the videos and side by side i read campbell in my fifth semester and uh, during my sixth semester i gave uh, uh, i solved mcqs as much as i can and uh, gave the test series and uh, revision sir in the last month that's it sir that was my strategy sir fine now Uh, how you uh, came across speed uh, sir uh, when i was actually finding it difficult uh, to you know read the entire campbell obviously and how to go through uh, about the urology preparation so um, when, uh, one of my seniors who has also joined uh, pj urology uh, last uh, year sir, last like 6 months back he also used speed and then uh, he told me about the video name? lectures uh, uh, dr shivaraman oh shivaraman sure, okay so he recommended you huh? <laughs> okay so uh, so that, that's how i started reading and i yeah, enjoyed the video like this sir so uh, there uh, sir has nicely covered uh, everything uh, in the session and uh, he has focused you know on what topics to read and he covered them elaborately so i i just focused on those topics uh, and read it from the campbell and solved the questions in those topics so that gave me an edge sir i believe okay. now uh, what about your uh... general surgery I mean did you prepare general yeah, surgery general, uh, actually my general surgery was a, a very strong sir and i think because of my general surgery only i got a rank i, I think i did not do uh, even a single question wrong in my general surgery as far as uh, i can recall the question sir uh, i did not prepare separately for general surgery sir i did not watch any single video or like solved mcqs for that whatever academics we have here at pj and whatever i have been reading uh, these standard textbooks and that's what sir i have been doing and that was the basis for my general surgery preparation what about your test uh, sir a test uh, so sir to begin with i gave my first test in around february this year 
and uh, and at that time I, was, I scored fairly you know, i scored around like 28 rank or 30 rank was my starting initial rank and then sir i gave uh, like tests every two weekly i tried to give at least two weekly tests and then uh, uh, then i improved and my last rank was i think six okay. that's what so you you gave how many uh, tests in speed app uh, I gave in speed up. I think uh, the, uh, combining the previous years as well as this years around fourteen to fifteen tests, sir. Oh, <laughs> yes. Sir. I solved the previous DTs as well. Like ten, I think were uploaded in the app uh, from the previous years. Just uh, solved those ten and the five uh, of the session, sir. I, I, I guess I solved fifteen tests, yes, sir. Okay, so I mean, when you when you looked into the videos on Campbell twelfth edition. And I mean, how how you used to I mean read Campbell and look into the video or see the video and look uh, into the Campbell from Speed and Campbell. Sir, so I uh, initially read few topics. Uh, in fact, so many of the topics from Campbell during my first semester. Whatever cases I used to see my, in my urology postings, I used to go back and read from Campbell. But then I was not able to you know uh, understand many things obviously because it was a completely new subject for me, new things, many of the new things for me. So when I after I watched videos, I realized that uh, I was not focusing on the right things, or I understood things uh, in, uh, in a way. Matlab, things are to be understood in a different way, and rather than what I was uh, doing. So sir, I watched videos first. I made notes uh, of not all the topics, sir, because of the time constraints that we have set. Like I could uh, barely make notes. I would just watch videos, and then I would go on and uh, read Campbell. So that's how, and uh, then whatever I marked the important things in Campbell, and and I would simultaneously write whatever sir taught uh, the different things in the videos and important points. I just mentioned the Campbell for last uh, revision, last one and a half months. I read that the Campbell with uh, the modified notes, whatever I had added in that. So were you able to finish all the videos? No, sir, I was not. Uh, I finished the only sir as in my like my seniors told me the important things which are frequently asked. For example, the oncology part. For example, the calculi part. This is the parts I think I focused on. I mean, I, obviously, I was uh, since being sir, uh, being with my MS exams, I had to cope <laughs> up with that. I could not complete the video, sir. Okay, right. So you went on through all the high yield areas for the exams. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's it. I went on through high yield areas. Very good. Now, how many questions did you attend this exam? Uh, Seventy nine, sir. Oh, fantastic. Now, can you tell me something on your interview? How did you prepare your interview and how the interview was? Yes, sir. Uh, so, sir, basically from the interview, again, my seniors guided me uh, a lot about the interview. Uh, that uh, And also the previous, um, uh, I think, speed, mein, we have uh, one previous mock interview session which uh, Farooq sir has uh, taken and he's uploaded it on app. So, I watched that uh, video on uh, speed as well. Uh, one and a half hours, like sir, it was, and sir, it beautifully covered like uh, how the interview would go on, like starting with your, uh, starting with uh, your publications, your research work, and then followed by a logical image, uh, surgical specimen, and followed by an instrument. So that's how exactly my uh, why my uh, mock inter my interview was sir. It like uh, went for approximately four to five minutes, and uh, in that they asked me about my research work and academic uh, publications and the conferences that I have attended. I told them about that. And then the second question was an, a radiographic image they gave me. And uh, the third was a uh, surgical specimen of radical prostatectomy. And the uh, fourth one was an instrument, sir. It was an engage uh, basket, a stone retrieval basket. That's it, sir. That's it, they asked. Great. Now, what is the message that you want to give to your juniors who are aspiring for MCH urology? Uh, first of all, I like to say that uh, many of the people, you know, I think I many of my, matlab, I see my seniors as well and many of my colleagues as well. So what they would try to do is try to cover everything. And, uh, you know, so I, I would like to stress that, you no, know, firstly, ke you need to find ke what the important topics are. You need to have a focused study rather than you know giving equal importance to all the topics. It's practically impossible to cover all the topics. Being, uh, you know, being, sir, uh, being a UG student or for that matter, it's, it's a difficult. Second thing I'd like to stress is people you know, don't focus on general surgery and uh, they read about the speciality more. And that's what I think. I think general surgery is what the, it either makes or breaks you because it, okay. I think the speciality part does not make much of a difference. But that's what I at least uh, you know think. Okay. And my general surgery was very strong. So that helped me. Sir. Thirdly, I would say that. Okay, um, it's important that we start early 
uh but uh, if uh, you know if you have uh, if you have understood the concepts well or uh, if you have read the, the book textbook one it uh, it's, it hardly requires uh, around two months of dedicated preparation to crack the exam it's not like you need to study for six months uh, and continuously for the exam that's what i would say said to my great great wonderful precise very precise and very informative can you tell us i mean now is the time for you to I mean to use this platform you can for thank whom all you want to who have built your career help you to build your career so far and yes sir uh, yeah, obviously sir so i start with my uh, entire general sales department at pjs you know whatever the department has taught me has uh, of been a great value and great importance sir like everything the not only general surgery in every department sir so i'll thank uh, sincerely thank the entire pj team for that i sincerely thank uh, farooq sir and uh, for the urology whatever he has taught he has been amazing and it really helped me to give you know give, give a direction towards my preparation otherwise otherwise it wouldn't have been possible also to my parents and uh, and to my wife sir who have always been supportive to me and without them it was not possible yeah. wonderful great now we had a very very brief interview from you as a very informative students so definitely will be benefited out of it once again we wish you all the very best and all the success uh, for a great career in neurology and this is the most passionate field that you wanted and it's there with you and definitely you will feel very happy about it and doing it and definitely you'll serve yes, thousands and millions of people are going to come to you all the best yes sir thank you so much thank sir. you thank, thank you, you. Thank you.